hello guys welcome back to good tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix loan moving simulator is having trouble and uh, many of the users are not able to use it because of some uh, error like game failed black screen and you're having uh, it is not able to start and many errors so we're going to talk about how we can fix this so i'm going to show you some of the basics to which you have to try out so the first one is when you're having the trouble uh, if you're having the trouble on your Epic Games launcher, you just have to go over here and you just have to right click and navigate to task manager. From here, as you can see, we'll be getting an option called Epic Games launcher. So you just have to right click and go for end task. Okay. So once you're done with the end task, most probably the issue has to be fixed. Parallelly, I'm suggesting you some of some more of the step which you have to try out. So uh, once back then you, you can launch the game. So next is all about you have to install Visual C++ on your Windows PC or laptop. So here I have already provided the link which I'll be giving in the description so you don't have to worry. So this link will you take you to Microsoft Visual C++ <coughs> sorry redistributable latest support downloads where from here you have to download for 86 and 64 as you can see here I have installed the both okay. So you have to download depends on your PC. If your PC is for 64 bit, you can go for this one. If it is 86 bit, you can go for this one. So here I have downloaded and installed it. So I'm not going to install it. But in your case, if it's not installed and if you're for the first time, you can download and install it. After installing, most probably if you go back to the Epic Games, Epic Games launcher and you try to play the game, this has to be worked. Even if it's not working, you have to update your graphics card which means you have to update it manually as well as uh, from here with so there are two methods one you have to update it manually for example if it is nvidia you can go to this link which i'll be giving in the description if it is amd you can go to this so if you move to the amd mine is amd so this is what it would take you me from here i have to select the graphics card from here i have to select the respective model which is my model i have to select the respective one and uh, once i select the respective one i'll be getting the next instructions and uh, i have to go over here and i'll be getting the instructions and i have to uh, down according to the windows 11 i have to select and i have to download it once after you download it then uh, i mean you once you download and install it you just have to uh, do one more step which is called you just have to go over here in the start right click and navigate to device manager from here in the device manager will be getting an option called display adapters expand this one uh, double uh, right click over here and also update the driver search automatically as you can see this is also up to date so which is very important after installing the uh, I mean installing the drivers manually you can go back to the big games launcher and you can uh, try to uh, check and most probably the issue has to be fixed even after trying this if it's not still not working then we just have to move to the next one next one is all about you have to run the epic games launcher so over here as you can see uh, I have to uh, search here I have to right click so uh, this will go to the open file location now as you can see I have to right click so that I'll be getting properties so over here in the properties as you can see if you go to the compatibility so in some cases this will be ticked that means uh, compatibility mode rent this program in compatibility mode will be enabled so you just have to disable it okay which is if it is enabled you have to disable it and also you just have to go over here and make sure that you have to enable disable full screen optimization once it is done you have to enable this and go for apply and go for okay okay so i'll untick so you just have to tick this go for apply and go for okay after that you just have to close this do a restart on a pc and go back to the epic games launcher and try to play and most probably it has to be fixed even after trying this if it's still not working then we just have to move to the parallel workaround which is called update your windows so to update your windows you just have to go over here navigate to settings you will be getting the icon from here you just have to go to left side there is an option called windows update just click on this one now from here as you can see here uh, as you can see the update option so just go for update okay you just have to go for update and if you're having update just do the update installation do a restart and try to go back to the epic games launcher and try to play even after trying with the update if it's still not working we have to run the game on dedicated GPU that is you just have to go over here in the system just go for uh, display over here now just scroll down there is an option called graphics 
you have to select this one from here as you can see uh, these are the available games right now so here both the games are being already uh, run on the dedicated gp so for over here we have to add the game so you'll be having an option called browse you just have to click on this one so what happens is this will take you where the game is installed from here you have to select the uh, lawn moving simulator and once you add you'll be able to see it here okay then what you have to do is you just have to select this one you can select for both and there is an option called option you just have to click on this one and set into high performance okay so here you have to set this to high performance not for forza horizon or crap game don't get confused many users keep on asking the question i'm just showing you an example with with this one because here on my pc as you can see lawn moving simulator is installing right now because i have uninstalled it and i'm reinstalling back so because i have to check on another error and i have to upload it in my youtube channel uh, way as soon as possible so i am reinstalling i don't know whether it will work or not so i'm just uh, uh, following some procedure so in your case you will be having these uh, you will be having the game but here don't get confused with these games okay i have repeated many times don't get confused with this uh, these because here you will be able to see lawn moving simulator just click on the option and set into high performance once it is done you just have to close this and you have to go to the epic games launcher and you have to launch the game even after trying this all these things if it's still not working then most probably we have to think on some uh, workarounds like uh, verify integrity of game files as you know that so if you wanted to do the verify integrity of <coughs> game files i'll be showing you an example so here as you can see as i said earlier, uh, said earlier the uh, lawn moving simulator installing right now so i can't do with this one there is no option so i'll be showing you with the available games that is fall guys and valorant so here valorant also i have made uninstall so here we am having fall guys so if you wanted to verify the integrity of game file you just have to click on th this three dot menu for any game if you wanted to verify integrity of game file for any game just follow this instruction click on this one and you will be having an option called uh, you will be having so you will be having an option to verify integrity of game file so which can be done from here so you can do that and once it is done as you can see uh, it will be verified and most most of the users will be able to know that so you just have to uh, go for this one and once it is done you don't have to worry once it's successfully done i mean successfully verified because sometimes verifying will be fixing uh, many issues like if the files are corrupted you'll be definitely having the issue so uh, by fixing this the most probably the issue has to be fixed so uh, by uh, verifying the game most probably the issue will be completely fixed and actually what is right now going through lawn moving simulator i have seen many videos in the youtube but i just want to tell you guys this it is actually an end which is happening right now across the globe and the developers are trying to fix it but they haven't found any solution as far as i'm concerned they'll be uh, finding the solution very soon so you don't have to worry so uh, one step which i mentioned the last verify integrity of game file you just have to click on this one now as you can see you'll be getting the options for that you just have to play the game i haven't played that's why i'm not able to get it so you just have to play the game and you will be getting the options for that so once you're done with this one you can click on the launch option and most probably you'll be successfully able to launch and these are the basic steps which you have to try out and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification this steps in these videos can be done for game failed black screen not starting and all those things and see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye